For to us a child is born, to us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. This is the fourth week of presentation. Now, what I want you to note in this kind of focal scripture for uh, the Advent season, uh, which is fulfilled in the Christmas coming of Jesus, is I want you to notice that although in the book of Isaiah it talks repeatedly about how this figure, this person who comes, who, the suffering servant, the wonderful counselor, the king of kings, will, is, is going to suffer and to bear the sins of, as, as we later find out in the New Testament, in the form of Jesus, he bears the sins of the whole world. I want you to notice that in this particular passage, it's not the focus. There's something really important for Christians to remember that we usually forget, and it's this. The forgiveness of sins that God gives to us is a means to an end, not an end in itself. What I mean by that is Christ did not come simply to die for your sins. Hmm? Christ came, as it talks about in this passage, because God is establishing his son as, as the counselor, the wonderful counselor, the, the eternal ruler in the seed of David who will rule forever. So the forgiveness of sins is a necessary step along the way to God's end. Now, God had that end in mind from the very beginning of the Bible when we started in Genesis 1-1 and then in Genesis 3 we took a really sharp detour that took us into the depths of human sin and most of the Bible has us receiving from God uh, the, 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 the prophecy of how Christ is going to come and he is going to forgive our sins he's going to raise us up from our sin as he goes down into death we also will die and then we'll be raised up to new life the same way that he is but I want you to notice that the focus of the advent season is not the forgiveness of sins that's the means to the end the end is Christ coming to rule with fairness and justice of the increase of his government and of peace there will be no end on the throne of David and over his kingdom to establish it and to uphold it with justice and with righteousness from this time forth and forevermore. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will do this. If you would like more information on .w Evangelical Church, check out dotheword.org. Hear the word, do the word, .w.